Hello there, welcome to Five Foods Five Days. Today is Tuesday, and it's cooking week, or whatever. And we are going to show you how the Curtises cook their hamburgers. Which I love, oh yeah, okay, nice moves. Heat the pan first, and make sure it's nice and hot, but do not touch it. Next step is to remove the paper stuff from your Costco burgers, and place them on the pan. Remember that even Costco ground beef is filthy stuff, so you gotta make sure you wash your hands as good as you can get them. Okay, Mac, let's see them. Okay, good enough. Listen to them patty sizzle. Sounds like paper rustling. While waiting for the patties to, to, to you know, cook, then you can cut some cheese, yeah. That's a good idea. Hey, wait a minute, that's a bread knife, put that down, yeah. Hey, what is that, a popsicle? Uh-oh, it's a, uh, it's a, it cuts cheese. Now the fun part, flip them patties. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Now the other one, it's usually a good idea to use a spatula for this, but you can use your hands if you really don't have a spatula. But, but seriously, who doesn't have a spatula? That'd be, that'd be kind of strange. And now you wait for a little while. For a long while. Until they look something like this. So now you get to flip them again. Yeah. Flip. Now you get to cut some onions with the, the thing that cuts cheese, I guess. And it's best that you put the onions in the pan that you're cooking the hamburgers in. Not not your eyes. Don't put them in your eyes. That would hurt. There you are. Those will go good with your hamburgers. Another optional sighting is the french fries. Fries go really good with burgers. At least, I think so. I mean, especially when you have five guys. You know, five guys barging the fries. Don't forget to salt them! Salt, salt, salt. Say, doesn't this camera angle look a little familiar? By the third flip, it's time to add the cheese. Mmm, doesn't that just that look good? I'm hungry! And now it's time to go call everybody who's supposed to be eating dinner right now, but they're not because they're waiting for dinner to be ready. You gotta inform them, you know? And don't forget the beans! The beans! Very important. Beans. Gotta have beans. And so, with everybody together, they start making their burgers. Putting together plates, and there is much rejoicing. Take a look at the condiments we got. We've got, we've got mustard, we've got relish, we've got mayonnaise. Ooh, look at that mayonnaise stuff. And, uh, we got bread. I imagine you're going to voice it over. Uh, mustard, uh, mustard, mustard. Uh, that's some mustard. Hey, you. Ah, beautiful. We've got spinach and ketchup and onions and relish and mayonnaise. We've got onions that aren't cooked and, and lots of other stuff. And... Come on, Mom. Hey, what I tell you about forgetting the beans? Don't. Okay, we finally got everything together and we're ready to eat. Mmm, that stuff looks good. Oh, yeah. All them condiments put together in a big mixture of American food. And so, with the whole family successfully fed, you get to cook your own burger now! Hooray! Good job, Bill. Now you just gotta wait for a while. That'll take a while.